Oh, what's up everybody? I'm Matt Gary and on this very special episode of Coding with the Force, I'm going to show you a new app that I built that will allow your salespeople to stay up to date on the GameStop situation while they're working in your Salesforce org. All right, guys, so honestly, if you haven't heard about the GameStop stock situation, then I really just don't know where you've been. <laughs> I'm all in, and uh, hopefully you are too. <laughs> but anyway, if you're like me and most of the people I work with, you're looking at the stock 24-7, just interested in trying to figure out when it's going to go to the moon. <laughs> So I built something so you never have to leave Salesforce um, and neither do your salespeople or anybody else that's interested in it. Uh, you can just sit in your Salesforce org doing your work all day and uh, not be <laughs> as worried about leaving your org, I guess. So I made this uh, beautiful uh, GME ticker that you can put into your utility bar that actually goes out and grabs the current price of the stock. And uh, you can refresh the price of that stock whenever you want. Um, and, you know, obviously right now I'm making this on the weekend, so nothing's going to uh, come up. Uh, but, you know, it'll let you it'll allow you to refresh it a bunch of times every single day. So you never have to leave Salesforce. You can just pop this up, click refresh price, and uh, you're good to go. Then we've got another tab here that allows you to see the, the hottest posts on Wall Street bets. <laughs> So, I'm sorry. so if, if you're wondering, you know, what's what's the coolest thing going on on Wall Street Bets? This pulls in the top 20 posts. Uh, you can click on them. Uh, you know, if they have links to click on, some of them get redacted and uh, or pulled down and you can't see them. But that'll take you right out there. Um, and you can refresh these posts just by clicking that button. You can see the list was updated. And... Um, it uh, updated the list here. And then the last and final thing, and you'll have to update this on your own. I didn't have enough time to pull this in dynamically or even really know where to start in the two and a half hours it took me to build this. Um, I've got a crying hedge funders section. So these, uh, uh, this goes over, you know, different hedge funders crying about the whole GameStop situation. And... Uh, <laughs> It's a great time. So if you need, <laughs> if you're having trouble giving people um, doing work like me, I can't focus at all. Uh, you can now have this nice little utility bar component in your org and everybody can keep doing their job and this will just be there all the time. And also, if you're wondering... Um, should you sell, it's always going to remind you to keep those diamond hands strong, baby. <laughs> so sorry. Also, don't trust anything that this app says or does because the guy that made it just likes the stock and also none of this is financial advice. And additionally, I made this in about three hours. Um, it does call out to real places to get this information, <laughs> but I can't say I've tested it all that much. So, um, yeah, that's it. And honestly, if you haven't bought GameStop, for the love of God, just buy a share, man. Just buy a share, man. Please. All right, guys, uh, this has been a wonderful episode. Um, you can grab this on my GitHub if you really, really, really want this and you just want to throw it <laughs> for some reason. Um, it'll be there. And uh, that's it. Make sure to subscribe if you want more Salesforce videos. Uh, next time, they'll be a lot more technical and less stupid than this, but you got to ride the GameStop train a little bit. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. <laughs>